exactly why ideal is the place for Dylan and I. Good deal! I think that ideal is important because it accepts all types of people, but it is still a very good school. Being an ideal school is like being in the, in the hole. It feels really safe, it's comfortable. Everybody usually gets to know a bit about each other, and you can usually just be yourself. Thank you for creating the school. I'm really grateful because in public school I was really struggling, and when I came to the school, I feel like I've improved. I, I get you. Yep. Thank you. And Ideal is just a very diverse, accepting community. We didn't actually start out to start a school. We started out to find a place where our kids could find their horizon and be supported and championed and be with their peers. And that conversation led to the realization that that place just didn't exist. And that broader realization, there were so many other things about our educational system that are not ideal. And being nervous about co-educating children with kids with special needs, the whole concept of diversity is still a concept. And we set out to change and make the concept a reality. What we wanted to do that was different was to really embrace this idea of identity and difference and that everyone could talk about their differences, embrace their differences, and feel comfortable not just with their classmates' differences, but their own sense of identity and who they are. We are all different people here, and it's very accepting. So I guess that prompts changes in us because we see other people and we become ourselves here. When we had a K-8 school and we were thinking about what our students would do next, for high school there still was not this environment which was a smaller, more nurturing, inclusive environment with this continued focus on identity and social justice. So we decided to expand to the high school. My time at Ideal has been very eye-opening. It's very nice actually and refreshing to see that there's people who don't really care who you are, but they care about what you do. It's making us better people. We learn about things that usually don't learn about in other schools and how to have an open mind and speak out. What's next for Ideal is to scale it, to show that it works, to continue to have our kids go out there and show the world that because they grew up in an inclusive environment, they're thriving. Then Ideal's visibility to the world as a place that is relevant, that is necessary, and that should be replicated can thrive. I think the evolution of this concept and this movement, you know, it's not just a school, it's a, it's a life movement. Ideal is changing our world by creating a model in which all people can live and learn and grow together. Ideal makes a pretty big difference because they have so many students who are so diverse and so enriched in Ideal's learning community. It's really easy to make a difference if you go to Ideal. Ideal is part of a conversation to change our world and it won't change until more of our kids go out in the world and embody what inclusion and diversity can mean for excellence and acceptance and leadership. Max, Karen, and Alex, I'm so proud of the incredible work that you've done at IDEAL. You will be the first students to carry our vision for a world in which people who learn together learn to live together. Our initial gala was called with a little help from our friends because we knew we couldn't even possibly think of doing this without help from our friends. Making Ideal part of their life, embracing what we're doing, opening their time, their treasure, their talent to get on board and help us has been humbling and I can't thank everybody enough. Ditto. And just thank you to our honorees for this year's gala because these are basically our parents. We, we, we just love our parents just the way that they love us. On behalf of Dylan and I, thank you, Founders of Ideal, and thank you, Mitch, Hardra, and Michelle. Mom. Mom.